one. Make a new folder. Make two folders. Call them models and image templates. Grab all the files in the Pixify Tumblr. Find that in the description. Make a copy of the Bones list in your Google Keep for later. Now that's smart. Drag all your files into the image templates folder. Two. Open. Sims 4 Studio. Click Create 3D Mesh. Then click CAS. Choose part type here. Select a hair similar to what you're making. Press next. Call it something. Free. Export the hair for later. Click the meshes tab and export your item. Call it something. Four. Open. Blender. Locate the hat meshes by turning off the eyeballs. There they are. Temporarily delete the full head of hair. We'll bring it back later. Export as an OBJ. And call it something. Bring the full hair back. Five. Open. Maya. Six. Import your reference object. Apply the UV texture. Make or import some hair. UV your hair. Apply the UV texture to it. Fit it inside the hair space. Take a UV snapshot of your UV. Make it this size. Export your object. Call it something. Make the hat here if you wanna. Seven. Open. Photoshop. Eight. Import your UV image and the original hair image. Put them on top of each other. Duplicate the UV. Invert your UV. Select the mode Multiply. Make a Jill sandwich. Use your magic wand tool and select outside of the UV. Make a new layer and use your paint bucket tool. That should make it easier for you to paint. If you already have an image file, just place it on top. If you want to add baby hairs, just paint on the face section. Or do it all in 3D code. Nine. Import your hair files into Blender. Click the checkerboard tab. Remove any images that were there before. Press new. Go to open and select your image. Ten. There's two original hat mesh layers. So let's duplicate our one. Press shift and D. Eleven. Pick a hat mesh layer. Press tab. Press X. And delete. Do this on all the original meshes. Click your hat here, then shift click the original hat here. Press join. Attach the other hat mesh to the other hat mesh. And attach the full hair to the full hair. Twelve. Click this triangle tab. Click the full head of hair. Remove any joints that couldn't possibly touch the hair. Go bone shopping. Select a bone that may touch the hair. Go into edit mode or press tab. Click the plus button and paste your bone. Click your first joint. Make the weight one. Click assign. Do this to the others. 13. Select your main hair. Go to the weight mode. Select the second joint. Go here. Now one is far too much. So let's bring it down a bit. Paint your weight. Select your original hair. Then shift select a hat hair. Go to the weight mode. Click transfer weights. Do this on the other hair too. Click save. 14. Back to import your hair texture. Make the others blank if you don't have them. Go to the meshes tab. Import your blender file to every level of detail. If your texture has a transparent background, go to tools, modding, then glass shader. 15. Test it. Look at you! Aren't you an awesome hairdresser? Let me know what you've made. Is there anything you want to learn in The Sims? Drop a comment down below. For more pixie tips, don't forget to subscribe!